Hi, my name is Valentina from Spotterham and I'm here to show you a spacious three bedroom option situated on the fourth floor in Friedrichshain. You're very close to the River Spree as well as centrally connected via Ostkreuz. You're close to Kreuzberg. There's plenty of restaurants and pubs just close by and a short walk away. So the, this neighborhood has got plenty to offer and is very centrally connected on the ring as well as from Warsaw Straße on the U1. The, your closest supermarket is uh, Lidl, which is just a five minute walk away as well. Let's start with the tour. So you come in and on your right is the speakerphone answering system as well as the living room, which I'll show you first. There's a floor length mirror and a wardrobe and a drying rack as well as a hoover situated right next to it. This is a really long hallway on your right then again the first bedroom followed by the kitchen followed by a dining room area as well as the other two bedrooms at the very far end of the hall as well as the bathroom. So we'll start by the living room. You walk in. This is a very, very spacious room with plenty of light. I've been told that this is also a sofa bed option in case you have guests. The table seats four people. There's additional chairs throughout the flat as well if you need to shuffle chairs around. There's a flat screen TV as well as a chest of drawers. with some maps on Berlin, empty storage space for you to fill, shelving, more shelving. You've got a really nice view of this flat, as I said, like right there is the river, so it's actually right in front of you. You're on a main road, so you're centrally connected by car as well. You can take in the view from all sides of this flat. There's the sofa bed again, which is quite comfy and seats three to four people. Two armchairs. And a big mirror at the top. So, moving on through the hallway to the first bedroom. The first bedroom has two single beds in it. This could be ideal for a family, say a, two siblings sharing or two friends who are comfortable sharing together. There's empty shelving here. A small bedside table and storage space as well under the bed. Which is empty. It's quite nicely concealed. But yeah, all along the bed it has that. Show you the view as well. Onto another residential building. And a big mirror at the top. Got a coat rack here in this mid hallway. Moving through again, there's the dining room with a dining table and four chairs. This is quite a spacious area which one could fill with one's own belongings. And generally this flat is quite open plan with lots of openings and walkways just through, same as for the kitchen. This is the kitchen. A very modern washing machine, a drying rack for your dishes, you can lift this and you've got all your glasses in there, as well as mugs up the top. You've got a coffee maker and a kettle, you've also got a dishwasher, a big one which is quite spacious, some cleaning products and washing up products for your 
washing machine, as well as a big oven, an electric hob, and another shelf with your plates and your odd bits and bobs that you might need for cooking. There's also some basics as well as chopping boards and cooking utensils. More bowls here. There's a small bin right next to the fridge freezer. Your freezer's at the top. Fridge at the bottom. Got your toaster there. Microwave here. Your cutlery in here. And your pots. And more pots down here as well as sieves. So that was the kitchen. Walking back through the dining room. This is the second bedroom with one double bed as well as a single bed. Again, for people who are happy to share as well as a family with a child potentially. Got a bedside table, a long mirror, small table there, and the view on the apartment building there. Got a double wardrobe here, hangers in it. And plenty of empty shelving there. So, when you came from the dining room, on your right is the bedroom I just showed you, straight ahead the bathroom, which is shared with the other flatmates or family members. You've got a hairdryer, a mirror, a sink, a spacious bathtub, and rain shower head. I'll show you the last bedroom now. Bedroom number three. Small bin in the corner. Two bedside tables, a double bed, small chair by the window. That's your view under the courtyard from here. Empty shelving in this double door wardrobe. Thanks for joining me today. My name is Valentina. I really hope you enjoyed the tour and I know you'll enjoy staying in this three room flat, which has got plenty of space for however many people will be staying here and a great neighborhood to discover. If you've got any questions, please don't hesitate to get in touch via spotahome.com. We look forward to hearing from you. Auf Wiedersehen!